हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू माई चैनल दिस इज उदय पंडित एंड यू आर वॉचिंग एम ई पी टेक्निकल वर्ल्ड इन दिस वीडियो विल लर्न अबाउट इंट्रोडक्शन टू केबल सो बिफोर स्टार्ट दिस सेशन आई वुड लाइक टू रिक्वेस्ट यू इफ यू आर नॉट एट सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड ऑल्सो हिट दी बेल आइकन सो यूल गेट नोटिफिकेशन रिगार्डिंग माई अपकमिंग वीडियोज सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट इट सो बेसिकली वाट इज केबल सो केबल आर यूज टू कनेक्ट टू और मोर डिवाइसेस इनेबलिंग दी ट्रांसफर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिक पावर और इलेक्ट्रिक सिग्नल फ्रॉम वन डिवाइस टू अदर डिवाइस ओके सो इट इज अ मीडियम टू ट्रांसफर दी पावर फ्रॉम सोर्स टू डिवाइस ओके एज यू कैन सी ओवर हेयर दिस इज दी व्यू ऑफ द केबल ओके दिस इज दी पावर केबल फोर कोर वी हैव इंसुलेशन PVC insulation, armor, and then again insulation. So these are the seat we can say. And another is also. So this is the also cable. Okay, this is also cable. And if we talk about its material, so what are the materials used to make the cable? So these are copper. Okay, aluminium, steel. एस सी एस सी आर कंडक्टर जेनरली इट इज यूज इन ट्रांसमिशन लाइन सो दे इज ऑल्सो यूज ऑफ स्टील ओके सो दीज आर द मेटेरियल्स विच आर यूज इन केबल मैनुफैक्चरिंग सो मोस्ट एक्सपेन्सिव मेटेरियल इज कॉपर एंड इट हेज अ हाई कंडक्टिविटी एमंग दिस मेटेरियल ओके नाउ हेयर एज यू कैन सी हाउ द पावर ट्रांसफर फ्रॉम a cable okay so this is the source of power generation source of the power okay so this is the dc and another one is this is the main panel we can say ats panel okay simply and this is the transformer and this is the switch board power socket and through this switch board we got we are going to operate this bulb okay so this is also we can say electrical device and this is the electric heater okay so how actually uh, power transfer or reach to this devices so what is the medium so main medium is cable so this is the cable as you can see this cable will take a power from this dc and it will fed to this ats panel similarly power transfer from transformer to this panel through this cable okay now from this panel to switch board with this cable okay so these are the medium you can say cables keep the path to transfer the power from one device to another device so here from panel to switch board then to bulb okay similarly for here from panel to then power socket then to electric heater okay now let's come to the types of the cable okay as per the application so there are two types of the cables okay one is power cable okay and another is control cable okay so first let's talk about power cables so basically what is power cable a power cable is an electrical cable an assembly of one or more electrical conductors usually held together with an overall sheath and here we found one or more electrical conductor okay usually held in together held together with overall sheath um, we can say mechanical protection sheath covered like this okay so here as you can see this is the power cable so this is the four core power cable r y b and one is neutral over it we have a insulation then again seat then this is the armored which gives mechanical protection again we have a overall seat which is insulation it can be pvc it can be xlp now let's move on to power cable so it has also types so what are the types of the power cable these are lt cable and ht cable so what is lt cable lt cable means low tension cable okay then ht cable means high tension cable lt cable generally 
carry the voltage less than 1.1 kilo volt generally we use 440 volt during the three phase power transfer even we 220 for single phase okay so less than 1.1 kilo volt this cable can bear and more than this if voltage carry that means it will st cable so 11 kv line 22 kv line then 33 kv line these are in st cable okay now if we talk about its core lt cable core it comes in single core three core three and a half core and four core up to 61 number of core okay so these are the most commonly used core for lt cable and if we talk about core for st cable then it comes in only one core and three core because for st side generally we run three cores three phase r y b we don't need neutral that's why generally it is in delta connection that's why it required only three core or single core we can make separate core for single cable okay then if we talk about its insulation so it comes in pvc and xlpe okay then in st cable it comes in only xlpe okay so these are the brief so these are the basics of lt cable and st cable okay so according to our application we can go for lt and st okay now for lt cable it comes in armor and arm unarmored but in uh, st cable it comes in armor so generally this is for mechanical protection okay it gives the mechanical protection to the cable so if you talk about its application power cable application generally these cables are used in transmission and distribution of the electrical power as i've already briefed in previous slide so this is used in transmission line as you can see over here okay so these are the cable three phase cable single core single core okay again in the building or in the industry we use this power cable so this is the st or we can say lt cable even we use in building above it we have a earthing so these are the earthing cables even we use it in underground so these are the underground cables it might be st or lt okay so these are the application of power cable now come to sizes so in the market generally we found this size from 1.5 to 1000 square mm so these are the cable sizes 1.5 2.5 4 square mm 6 10 16 25 35 50 70 95 120 150 185 240 300 400 500 and 630 800 so up to 1000 square mm we can found in market these are the cable sizes for power cable now come to control cable okay so what is the control cable a control cable is a flexible instrumentation electrical cable designed for measuring and controlling and regulation in the field of process automation process automation generally it is used in automation system or control the any devices like contactor we can control any mode any motor any actuators so with the help of this cable we can operate the uh, relays in the automation field so the, these are the control cable which is only used to control the electrical devices to give the command okay that's why control cables are multi-conductor cables used in automation and instrumentation field okay it can be used to send the signal for on off command and to get the status of the each and every equipments in the automation field so generally this cable are used in that field okay so here as you can see contactor has a coil terminal a1 and a2 so this is the control terminal we can say so over here we use control cable similarly this is the push button are the parts of the control system 
it is also used control cable relays relays can operate it through the control cables okay to activate and deactivate the relay to switch on other devices like automated devices and actuator also we can control through this control cable motor switch on and off through this control cable so these are the application for control cables if you talk about its sizes it comes in 0 0.5 0 0.75 1 and 1.5 even 2.5 square mm so these are the size which can used in the control or automations field okay so hope you guys understand about basics of the cable introduction just we gave the inter introduction in this video what is the cable actually power cable and control cable okay so hope you guys understand about cable so thank you for watching this video please like share comments and subscribe and also hit the bell icon so you'll get notification regarding my upcoming videos so thank you very much see you again in next video